Hey guys, what's up? Parker Productions here. And today, it's another abandoned house. So, let's get into it. Here with my uh, friend Jeffrey here today. He's in my new Nikon camera. Not that, it, not that uh, any of you care. The road looks kind of uh, not that bad actually. There's a barn over there but we might go into it later. Look at this guy, this is crazy. That's what I always say. I don't think we're gonna be able to get into it, but we'll try. This is grown over right here. This is crazy. Nope, not possible. Oh, it smells though inside. Maybe from, looks like a handicapped person lives here. Just because of the ramp right there. Look at this guys, this is crazy. There's a path right there. Wow. It looks like this, uh... oh wow, this is a screen right here. Go ahead. No? I highly doubt this one. This one looks rusted. Oh, the knob turns, but this part right here is locked. Alright. That's crazy, guys. I cannot see inside at all. Huh. The grass is very long. There's cornfields right next to it though. Looks like people still like take advantage of the property and uh, still like, you know, the land. Very crazy guys. Very long. Wow. Old. Looks like they used to keep something here like cars or... That probably opens. Hopefully you guys can see in here. Yeah, there you go. You guys can definitely see in here. Flashlight doesn't really do anything for you guys though, but very hot in here. Yeah. I don't know what the heck that is, an old motor looking thing. Looks like an old belt for a car. A bucket. Thank you. This house doesn't look too crazy, to be honest. Mainly because, you try lifting that up. That doesn't really look locked. No, it's locked. Oh well. An old hose thing right there. Yeah, there's, it's pretty much, it's, look at this shack. It's pretty, yeah, alright, so now we're just going on like an old dirt path. Here's the, uh, whoever owned the place, the barn. It's cool because you can see, you can still see their landscape. Like that bush right there, that's, that's planted by, if you guys saw that, that's planted by, uh, humans. It's not naturally grown. So it's kind of cool to see how they used to, um, garden the place. Oh gosh, trespassing something. God damn it. Well, we're still gonna try it though. If anybody comes, we'll just tell them what we're doing. Hey, th no, there's a way on the back. I, I just saw through the cracks. Here we go. Foxhole thing right there. Man, this is old. What prints? Old box of hole, look at this. It's a ladder. Goes up. This is crazy. Southern Maryland antique president. I can't really read that just because there's words. But look at these old signs, guys. Pretty cool to have. It's like a. 
uh, old cabinets. Looks like birds live in here a little bit. Ladder thing, that's weird. Lots of holes and stuff for critters to live in. Old shovel right there. Oh yeah, probably should. The Southern Maryland Antique Auto Club is dedicated to the preservation, restoration, and enjoyment of antique vehicles. Man, this is crazy. Old oil can looking thing right there. Wow, dude. Man, you should keep this. Looks like someone just wanted to throw this away, so. Deep. Oh, really? All right. Look at all these Pepsi bottles. Man, that has a deep hole, dude. That's deep. Look at that, guys. That's crazy. Yeah. What is that? Car fuse. That's crazy guys, check that out. So, that's the barn. Um, so yeah, let me, uh, let's, we're gonna walk over to the other side to the barn, so we're just gonna skip uh, walking. All right guys, here's the barn. If you're wondering where, exactly where we are, that's where the shed were, was, that's where it is, sorry. And that's the house right there. We had to walk through this long, tall grass and Steps look worn as heck. A bunch of poop in here. Watch out, the floors are a little old. Oh yeah. Oh gosh. You know what this probably was? I'm thinking it was a chicken coop maybe. Yeah, a chicken coop. Oh, 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 oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Alright guys, I just had to stop the video because this was so creepy. I put it on night vision, that's why it's black and white. No more questions. You could not see it guys. So i putting this thing on night vision. Please don't move. That's a bird right there. Oh my gosh, that thing is so creepy. It's huge. It looks fake. Is it fake? No, it's not. That's not fake? It's real. I saw it eating. It's real? Yeah. This thing's big, guys. It's like pink. That thing is pink. So that's where all this bird poop stuff is coming from. Man, that's creepy. All right, guys, we're going to get out of here. Come on. This is not looking good. That thing's huge. Alright guys, yeah, so, like Jeffrey just said, that freaked the crap out of us. That thing looked fake. Um, so, gosh, dude, that was scary. That thing looked fake, didn't it? Yeah. That, I don't know what the heck that bird was, guys. I'm gonna actually go back in there and take a picture of it with a flash. Um, just so you get a better understanding of what kind of bird that was, maybe. But first, we're just gonna look through the windows of the abandoned house. There's the heater thing right there, whatever the heck that is. There shouldn't be anything in here. Oh, oh wow. Uh, I, you guys cannot see it, but it looks it's, it's pretty, carpet, it's yeah, it's pretty good in there. The so yeah, for you guys that couldn't see that, here's the, uh, the meter, the electric meter. And yes, I know the name now. If you guys watched my other video, I didn't know what it was called. So yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. It's crazy, guys. It has a circle driveway right here old tree that they planted, a uh, cherry tree. So yeah guys, that's pretty much it. One thing that really caught my eye to know this is an abandoned house is this creepy scraggly tree. But yeah guys, besides that, that's it. And uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. And uh, thanks for watching.